you doing? This is Chris with Dentless Touch. Back again with another paintless dent repair video. We have a, I believe this is a 2016 RX uh, 350 Lexus. Uh, this damage that you'll see right here in the video is basically um, right on the very edge. Really, really hard knock on the very edge. It actually, um, it's not where the hinge area, but there's still an indentation uh, from the factory uh, inside door panel. So it's a real tight area to work. And we're gonna see what we can do now. The challenges with this pair is two things, very close to the edge. And also, this is a high strength steel or ultra high strength steel door. This is a very, very difficult door to repair dents. It's actually worse than aluminum. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. So now I can actually see inside the center of the dent. So let's try to work it from the window. We have most of the dent out, but there's still a little bit left. Let me show you. So, Tim had to take out the window so we can get a better angle. A lot of work for one little dent. Let me guys show you what the door is looking like. So door panel, trim molding, window. As Tim puts everything back together, I'm gonna show you the tools that I use for this repair. So I may not have the part number with me right now. My tools are so dated, but this is a dent craft shave tool that they use. That they sell, sorry. Here it is right here. And all the tools will be in the link in the description below. This is what got most of the dent up. This is, man, this is, doesn't even have a uh, part number. They normally edge the part number in. But anyway, this is a ultra dent tool, shave tool. It has a longer foot. I really like this tool. Very, very strong, I guess, stainless steel that they use. So very good tool. Then my finishing tool was this whale tail right here. I used three other whale tails. Nothing got on that dent like this one. So this one is a fairly newer tool. And I still don't have the part number on this tool, but this is a dent craft tool and I will always leave the part numbers in the description below. So let me show you what the finished product looks like. Mm -hmm. 